Hello and welcome to another update video about Matic. So on the Matic chart, as you can see, the support area is still holding there. The yellow support zone, nothing is broken. So the overall setup and structure is still valid. Um, we're still dealing with a question here on this chart if the wave two already bottomed as per the white scenario, the white micro count, which shows you the pathway higher that we need to see filled in to keep the um, well to keep the possibility alive that a low has already formed in wave two. We're going to zoom in in a minute and then in the yellow count we might actually see one more low. I mean that move up here is definitely not too high for a fourth wave. So I'm going to zoom in. It's important to realize that there are two levels that matter. One is or two support levels really. One is the 49.5 cent level. That's the invalidation point of this bullish assumption, a 1-2 setup. And the 58.2 cent level is the last reliable support level. So below that level, invalidation becomes very likely. Zooming in, you can see that I'm tracking the move down as, whoops, one second. I'm tracking the move down as an ABC structure. And then we have here in this ABC structure, five waves in the C wave the fifth wave might start soon, okay? So what I'm labeling there is a fourth wave rally to the upside. This is what's currently unfolding, could still get one more high, could still be a fourth wave in an ending diagonal. So actually I should add the 61.8 retracement because a lot of coins are currently working on ending diagonals and especially here the wave one looks like a three wave move. So yeah, it indicates that maybe here this C wave is an ending diagonal. So the fourth wave might stretch a little bit higher. Um, but a break above 75 cents would already be a first indication that we are moving up possibly towards that white target zone. And that target zone is relevant for the white scenario. So the third wave to the upside that we need to see as part of the bullish structure, short term bullish, needs to reach 86.2 cents to really believe that um, or to keep that white count alive. Okay, So that's sort of one of the key milestones. Third wave should reach that level 1.38 extension. And we need to see five waves to 91.3 cents. So to the 61.8 extension, um, to the 1.618 extension, because yeah, otherwise we don't really have a valid or reliable five wave pattern. Okay, so that's what we're tracking at the moment. And um, at the moment, this is just a corrective rally, as it seems, just a three wave rally could easily fail still. And if we get a break below that, what I've labeled here is wave too low, at 61.5 cents or 61.7 cents, that would be good confirmation that the fifth wave to the downside in the yellow count is unfolding. Next support, I already mentioned that, is at 58.2 cents. And below that, re really the only other level, I mean, the 49.5 cent level is the invalidation point and the 88.7 FIP level is at 53.7 cents. That would be another support level, but uh, it's a level I don't trust. I mean, normally when the prices get there, it's gonna fail eventually but there are always exceptions you know it's not a hard rule it's more like a guideline as long as support is holding and if the white wave count is filled in um, then we are looking for a third wave target up there for the next larger rally of $1.76 plus and the fifth wave should reach $2.13 plus these are the key levels for the next larger rally to the upside but there's still plenty of work to do actually to get there so there is not much more to update really at the moment. It's a bit boring. <laughs> Still uh, wanted to update you on Medic's price action. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.